Hello everybody, welcome back to the channel. I'm Chris from Game Buds, and today I am showing you guys a Spurs basketball game. All right, and what I mean by that is, oh, <laughs> me and Gabby, we have created a Spurs basketball game in Minecraft. Check this out, boys. Yes, look, there's Gabby down there. She was able to get some pretty good tickets. They uh, they actually allowed her to uh, go down there and shoot the ball a little bit. So, kind of jelly, but whatever. That's okay. Hi, babe. I'm up here. I'm just flying around. Don't mind me. I'll let you get back to practicing. Uh, so anyway, guys, yeah, this is a Spurs game in Minecraft. This is so cool. Look at this. Very, very nice. I, man, I am proud of our arenas lately. Uh, if you guys haven't been to a game, you kind of get a sense of uh, of of size just like this. The court, it's nice and big. And of course, you got the jumbotron in the middle. Uh, Gabby, of course, once again, blew my mind with the size of this arena and and just how fast she got it done. It took her about two and a half hours to get this uh, arena done total. I think that was the total time. So very, very good. Shout out to to Gabby. Um, we worked on the roof in about 45 minutes. Didn't take too long. It's not as big as the Prince stage. Uh, Prince? Did I say Prince? Prince. Prince stage. But, uh, yeah, still pretty massive. So, down on the court, of course, we have, right down the center, we have the Spurs logo. Very cool. We had a look at a couple pictures to see how we could make it look decent without overdoing it. We didn't want the size to be too grand. Um, and we didn't want it to be too small and look all squished. So we kind of got a little idea off of Google. That's a pretty good looking image. You can tell what it is. And then, of course, on either side, I did the Spurs, uh, just the word, on either side, upside down. So it says Spurs and Spurs right there. Uh, Gabby right here, she's shooting her basketball. Not Oh, my gosh. She had a bunch of basketballs. <laughs> Not doing too good at it, though. Uh, but, yeah, here is one of the NBA uh, basketball courts up here. As you can see, you have... I have spider. Oh, there you go. Hey, three pointer. She did the Michael Jordan jump. I got spider web acting as the netting. Uh, just use glass as the backboard and the rim. Uh, nothing too crazy. I did have an extra orange uh, piece of glass going down the the middle here, which acted as the entire rim. But I thought maybe uh, you know, uh, spider web will look more like a, a netting itself. So there you go. Pretty cool. Um, this was just, I looked up a Google image of a NBA official, I guess, basketball court, and this is exactly what it looks like. Nothing too crazy. Of course, there's like little logos on, on the arm right here. Um, you got this, the buzzard up here. Of course, zero seconds. Number 23, we all know who that is, right? So I just used a, what is it, glowstone or a, a lamp or whatever. Use that. So when it goes off, <coughs> that's end of the game right there. Uh, same thing on this side, exactly the same thing. I just changed the number, number 08, of course. Um, and yeah, so that's pretty much the courts. Over here, we have either side. <laughs> what was that? We have either side for, for the teams and their little Gatorade coolers. I'm sure you can tell what that is right there. Just two little Gatorade coolers. Got all the chairs for the team. Uh, I got the announcer's table and the ref's table right here down the middle. Of course, there's a screen on the front, so we put that on the other side. Uh, just more team seating and their little Gatorade stands right there. So there you go. This is exactly what it is. Hi, babe. Look at her their ball. Very, very cool. Yeah. Um, so just so you guys know, we didn't replicate the AT&T Center itself. We did just make a Spurs game. We just wanted to make a sports arena. So uh, don't look for any any accurate representation of the AT&T Center itself. Maybe one day if we learn how to build... Um, arenas to to scale but we're not there just yet uh, if we go up a little further we have the jumbotron of course so got a big giant screen anything with light gray concrete like I always say is the screen right there of course you got the amplifiers on every corner that way the crowds can hear what's going on um, and then right here all these little colors are supposed to represent like the scoreboard up there sometimes they'll put fourth quarter uh, you know 21 to, to 25 whatever um, and you'll see the numbers up there if you look up. So it doesn't matter where you sit. The jumbo screen is in a big circle. So if you're sitting on either side of the arena, you got a pretty good view of the game and of the score and everything that's going on, you know, kiss cam and all that good stuff. So uh, that's pretty much that. Um, 
on either side of the court, we happen to put SA Texas. So if you are from San Antonio like I am, you know, represent, shout out. So we do have this right here uh, to just show some love. And then on the other side as well, SA Texas. Nothing too crazy. If you guys do want to see how to build this, I'm not going to do a tutorial, but there is a screenshot right there to do the court. That's exactly what it should look like. Um, speaking of the court, it is made out of sand. <laughs> we didn't want to go with the wood. We thought the sand looked a little bit more natural. Uh, put some glowstone where all the lines had to be and then just covered it with carpet. So nothing too crazy there. Fairly simple to do. Gabby and I, I say total, it took us about three hours, three and a half hours to finish this arena from, from uh, the floor to the roof to the seats to the court to the stairs. Like, it wasn't that hard at all. We're getting better and faster at, at building giant arenas like this. Even if it's a mid-size like this, it's not as big as Prince, but it's not as small as, say, um, the the Def Leppard arena we did or the, the Kiss arena. You know, it's not as bad as, or as bad, not as small as that, but it's also, you know, not the biggest we've ever done either. So I think it came out fairly nice. Babe, you want to pass me the ball? See if I can uh, see if I can shoot one. Oh my lord! <laughs> Look at all the balls. There, right? I got one. Uh, do I have it in my hand? I can't tell. I have. I think I have my hand turned off. There we go. All right. Here we go. Watch this, love. <laughs> run it up. Run it up. Eh. I'm way too small. Yeah. <laughs> nope. Oh my goodness! I'm way too tiny for this. <laughs> hey, you gotta run and do the Michael Jordan jump. Go. You gotta run. And then from half court jump. All right, ready? Ooh, she just flew through the air. <laughs> Yay! She didn't even let it go. <gasps> nope, I'm not good at this. All right, well, <laughs> while Gabby keeps shooting uh, three pointers and uh, just a bunch of free throw shots, I am going to say goodbye to all of you guys. So thank you so much for watching. I do appreciate uh, everybody tuning in. You guys are amazing. If you guys want to see more sports arenas such as football stadiums, basketball uh, stadiums, maybe even baseball and hockey, things like that, please let us know. We are willing to make whatever you guys want to see. Just give us time. It's only two of us, so um, we are willing to do that. But uh, once again, thank you so much for tuning in. Look, there goes Gabby. Bye, babe. Thank you for being in another video. Appreciate it. <laughs> thank you so much for tuning in please like and subscribe go check out the podcast link check out the website we now have a website uh it's called gamebudsofficial.com gabby has actually purchased the rights to that name so it is ours now uh, when it comes to websites gamebuds official is now licensed to us so that's pretty dang cool but uh yeah if you guys are sports fans let me know also down in the comments what's your favorite sports team who's your favorite player maybe it's not basketball just let me know you know what sport tickles your fancy so if you guys are into all that thank you so much i will catch you guys in the next video leave a like and subscribe and i will see you next time bye bye